Mr. Powers, let me ask you about guns on college campuses. Uh, you know that there's been some legislative action or attempts to, to, uh, to see some legislative action with regard to guns on campus. Your chancellor was one of the only administrators at a, an institution of higher education to publicly oppose this. In fact, he was almost first out of the gate in publicly opposing this. What do you think about this? Should we be inviting uh, concealed handguns onto college campuses? Uh, no. Uh, and I... <laughs> Let Every one you, of these people is off-centered to Wentworth's Christmas card yeah. list. I'm just going <laughs> to say, I, I, if I could say a few things about this. Senator Wentworth is a great senator. He's a thoughtful senator. I, I disagree with him on, uh, on, on this. Uh, I know it's a controversial issue. I, was, I wrote an editorial uh, in the last session publicly opposing handguns on the campus. I've been in the, uh, interviewing newspapers and publicly opposed handguns on, on campuses. Let me say my concern. I understand the scenario. Somebody is attacked. There's a particular situation. Well, you just had a gunman on campus. Yes, yeah, they, they right. might have a, yeah. somebody might have a gun and protect themselves. I, I understand that. That comes, and, and we had a gunman on the campus. Even when we have a gunman on the campus, our students immediately afterwards and our police department say it's very important that when there's a situation like that, they can sort out the good guys and the bad guys. It's going to be very dangerous for somebody to have a visible gun in a situation like that. Uh, police are going to try to be very careful, but it's a ver those are very confusing situations. The other issue is those situations come uh, hopefully never, once in a decade, uh, once over a period of time. We're always vigilant uh, against those situations. Friday night comes once a week. Uh, young people and alcohol and disputes and guns, I think, are not overall a good mix on our campus. There are accidents. Uh, there, there are all kinds of things uh, uh, that can happen with guns and young people and alcohol that are not good things. And those, those come up week after week after week on our campus. Uh, Dr. Lofton, the Aggie perspective on this, please. You are for this or against this? Uh, quite simply, uh, Bill and I agree on this, this point very much. I've, I've really, in my public statements, echoed that of my law enforcement personnel who say to me, it's hard in a second to determine who a good person, a bad person is in this particular circumstance. They don't want to make a mistake. Secondly, for the second time in, in three years, we had a referendum among our students here, and 57% were against it. So the student body as a whole has said pretty clearly twice now in the last few years that they believe this is not something they want to do. So that's the two things from a and M that I like to point out. Well, uh, Mr. Powers was declarative. I said, okay. do you support this? He said, no. Would you be declarative and say you do not support this? I follow my student leadership here. The student leadership is very, very clear saying they don't want to see this happen. My law enforcement said the same thing to me. I certainly support both of those. Okay.